Hey guys, it's Katie Cakes here, and today I'm going to be doing my um, TBR um, and my Romance Opoly uh, rolls. Um, this is probably all I will have for this month is my Romance Opoly rolls because um, I am going to be doing the mystery challenge uh, this month as well, which is for me going to be quite long. Um, so, <laughs> yeah. Um, this is what I've done so far. Uh, so I have the coffee shop, and then the nightingale, and the knife of never letting go. And uh, I'm going to be trying again with that square. So I'm reading uh, Stalking Jack the Ripper by Carrie Maniscalco. I don't think I said that properly. Um, but I'm going to be reading that for this square because I really hated The Knife of Never Letting Go. What I've decided I'm going to do is that if I hate a book um, and I end up rating it like under three stars, I'm going to try again with a different book um, until I find one that is at least three stars. Um, and then I read Off the Clock and Bad Hour by Ronnie Lauren and uh, Two by Two by Nicholas Sparks. And then if you watched my last video, you know what's going on with this square. I thought I was supposed to read my Cozy Corner um, mystery book, but I'm supposed to be reading a historical fiction with a class disparity, which I'm not doing, so I'm going to say that I'm doing Cozy Corner, and yeah. But that is my little recap on that. And, uh... Last time, I had stopped here, but since we said I'm going to do Cozy Corner, so we will go there, and we will, yeah. Okay. So my first roll is a seven. So I have a library that I can't do yet, so we will do Alien Avenue. Which is read a sci-fi romance or a sci-fi novel. Um, so I'm thinking that I can use the 100 for that. Um, but I'm going to double check before I do. If not, I will find another book or series that I can read for that. And I will let you guys know what that ends up being. Um, but yeah. For that one, we'll try doing... The 100 by Cass Morgan for um, Alien Avenue. So that's my first roll. Um, and I'm going to be rereading, uh, stock, or er, redoing the um, Growing Pains Square. So that's going to be Stalking Jack the Ripper. Um, I guess two, since I told you guys about it already. Um, I'm going to be doing the mystery challenge um, that you're able to do between February 1st and April 1st. Um, so for that, it's... Uh, Read a paranormal romance with a faded mate's trope. And in the recommendations there, it said that you could read the uh, Throne of Glass series. So I'm going to be reading that. I have Throne of Glass and Crown of Midnight. Um, and I think I have a c four more on their way here. Um, through Book Outlet right now. So I'm going to be finding the rest of that series and reading that. So, yeah, that's the the mystery. Okay, um, so that's still technically only one roll, so I'm gonna do, f uh, three this month and see what I end up with. Um, so this is nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That is Kick Ass Lane. Kick Ass Lane is 
read a urban fantasy with a picture of a kick-ass heroine on the cover. Um, so for that one, I think I'm going to read White Trash Zombie by Deanna Rowland. Um, but I have to make sure that I can find it first. Um, if not, I'll read Some Girls Bite by Chloe Neal or Red-Headed Stepchild by Jane Wells. But we will first try for uh, White Trash Zombie. And then my last roll of the month is a two. That's the coffee shop that I've done already. And I've done this square. And I'm doing this. <laughs> and I've done this square. So we will be on the last blue square. And that is... Something Avenue? Women's Avenue? Uh, so... Read a women's fiction novel. So for that one... I picked uh, Big Little Lies by Leanne Moriart Moriarty. So, yeah. Um, I know it doesn't seem like that many, um, but the Throne of Glass series is pretty big. Uh, the 100 is five books long. Uh, Stalking Jack the Ripper is three books long. And I don't know if White Trash Zombie has anything else on it or with it. So it is quite a big TBR this month. And I will try and get through all of them. Um, I am going to be reading the, um, the ones that I rolled first, and then I will do the mystery, because I feel like the mystery is going to take me a lot longer, and I'm not even sure if I'll like the Throne of Glass series, so if I don't, I will have to find another book to read for that. Um, but yeah, that is my March TPR for my Romanceopoly, and yeah, I will keep you guys updated um, on if I end up doing any more. Um, so yeah, I will talk to you guys later.